hello 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 dreamers and welcome back to dream queen by perilla as always guys thank you for all your love and support thank you for liking sharing subscribing to the channel and if you haven't done so i encourage you to do so it helps with growing the channel getting the video out there for more people as well as keeping me accountable for personal readings all that information can be found down below in the description so we are going to go ahead into virgo libra cusp for this week um there there is an offer of some sort um and again guys these are general readings so this can be in love at work or something like that but it's something that gets you very excited it's something that brings in um opens up a lot more opportunities so i'm definitely picking up more of a vibe of of work or just like an invite of going out or something where you get to meet more people or something like that because it there is an expansion coming in if this offer is accepted um and and it's almost kind of like you don't you don't see it coming it's something that happens almost kind of like out of the blue so um be prepared for an opportunity coming in through an offer of some sort um whether it is that someone is trying to collaborate with you or somebody offers to like start a business with you or something of that matter but there is a huge offer coming in that ultimately is going to be changing the course of your life now for those of you <clears throat> and again I try to keep the love portion out of things, but some of you do have an ex that is trying to come back or is trying to reach out. Um, this person is still dealing with someone else. Just letting you know, I don't know who needs to hear that. I don't know if it's that you can't wait till Friday to hear it, but it is what it is. So just kind of be mindful of that. That person still has open options, whether it is that they're still physically um, intimate with someone else or they're still talking to someone else, but they're having, they haven't cut ties with somebody that they were messing with or talking to. Now, when it comes to you, you're being told to release any any guilt that you have um, towards yourself about not seeing something or not realizing something quicker or not walking away from a situation sooner. Um, it's almost kind of like, okay, those were lessons. Those were not meant to bring you down. Those were not meant to have you in this pity party type of thing. You got things that you need to get done. You got, you got places you need to show up to. You have way too much going for you at this moment to to sit in a pity party for yourself, meaning um, be feeling so extremely guilty over things that have already passed, right? Things that you cannot change, um, and it is what it is. It's kind of like the energy that I'm picking up. Um, you you have again whatever this offer is is opening up opportunities in areas that you didn't even think possible. And whatever these, whatever these doors that are opening up or these new opportunities that are coming from this offer are not, they're not delayed. So it's not like you have to wait like, you know, like five years or something like that. It's something that is coming in very, very, very quickly. So we have the truce, which is the four of swords, the nine of pentacles, which is gain, and then the three of swords, sorrow in the reverse. So it, it is your time um, in whatever area of your life you've been waiting for your time. You've been waiting for an opportunity. You've been waiting for an offer. You've been, you've been waiting for this and it is here. And it's here to to show you or to prove to you like all of your hard work or all your challenges, whatever it is that you have faced up to this point, um, this is where it was leading you. Um, for this offer, again, this can be an offer at work. Maybe somebody's leaving and you're being promoted or something of that matter, but it is, it is here for you. So do not hesitate because I do feel that um, some of you are might, might want to hesitate. Um, 
And if somebody is fired or somebody is demoted or whatever it is, it has nothing to do with you. Um, everybody has their, their role to play, right? And that is something that just had to happen in their life for whatever the reason. So don't ever feel guilty for celebrating your accomplishment, even if that means that somebody else is losing. Because you're not you're not celebrating their losses, you're celebrating your accomplishments, right? Um, and just wish them the best and whatever it is that they're going to go into. But that hesitation energy can definitely stop you from taking this offer, taking this opportunity. Um, and it would be very, it would be very sad for you to see this, to allow this to pass by because again, it is, it is, it's almost kind of like bringing this energy of like, all of your wishes are coming true from this offer. Like this is like the, the starting point of everything that you have been trying to manifest. So let's go ahead and let's pull out an Oracle card. Now this can be confirmation to the reading, your advice. Or something that you're not seeing clearly that you need to be made aware of. Hollow bone. Hollow bone teachability number 28. Right? And when we talk about teachability, it's about learning. And for you, a lot of the learning is allowing yourself to receive. Um, a lot of the learning is celebrating when you receive. A lot of the learning is letting go and not feeling guilty for whoever is staying behind or whatever it is that you did in the past that may have hurt someone else. If you apologize and you made peace with it and the person still wants to hold the grudge, it is what it is, right? We have to, uh, at some point, learn that we're only in control of so much and we're not in control about how other people um, feel, how other people interpret things. We're not in control of how they perceive it or the anything when it comes to another person, right? And this is, you know, this is kind of like the the lesson that you learn, you're, you're to learn this week. Release any guilt that you have from the past and allow yourself to celebrate what it is that is coming. Allow yourself to accept that offer and allow yourself to be happy. Allow yourself to embrace it. Allow yourself to be grateful and let go of the freaking guilt. <clears throat> well, guys, that is all that I have for you for this week. As always, thank you for your love and support. Sending every single one of you love, strength, and blessing, guys. Take care. Love you all. Bye-bye.